Yo guys, Zama 25 here. Today we're on the final world, I'm uh, not final, we're on world 8. This is the world where we fight Big Bowser. So, we're in world 8 today. And like basically, yeah, we're Zama 25 back again in world 8. And then today, we've got to do, so we're currently on world 8-1. World 8 has like 10 levels. It's got 7 normal levels and it's got 3 boss fights. So we've got 10 levels to do today. This episode might be quite long, pause. Uh, but basically, we're going to beat this as soon as possible, pause. Uh, I'm not cool, Marnie. Anyway, so we're on hold 8 dash one. Uh, uh, I'll be honest with you guys. This level's really easy. The first star coin is right here, you've got to jump up and get that. So we're trying to hunt the game. The first star coin, very easy. Checkpoint here, I've got my first checkpoint of this world, it's very nice. Guys, checkpoint, yeah, nice. Oh yeah, for, the, for you guys wondering, once you get to the 99 lives, Mario takes his hat off. So if you ever wonder what Mario's hair looks like, uh, just make it, uh, get 99 lives and his hat will disappear. This only works on this game, uh, not any others, but still, second star coin, you need to get that power block, throw it on the floor, and you'll collect it. Now wait for these fire guys just to fall down, and you can just jump over that. Okay, I damage boosted through the thing, but I'm still big, of course, oh, okay, I'm not... Okay, I've took too much damage now, I cannot get this third star coin. It's not possible to get this unless a, a meteor falls from above and breaks the bricks, but they just don't want to today. Hidden one up there. Okay, now, right, can I get a star coin now? Could it go, go, go? Oh, I've missed it, and I'm going to have to kill myself and come back in the level. Well, third star coin, it'd be big to get that. Alright, here we are back again. I've, I was about to say I've got a propeller, but I lost it. So you need to be big so you can break the bricks and get the uh, thing. Uh, you cannot break these bricks from above because there's coins in here. So if you try to ground pound from above, if you try to ground pound from above, it will just give you coins. It won't uh, give you that one that you go through. And that's the end of 8 1. Right now we're on 8 2. This has a non work and secret exit, so we need to make sure we get both. So basically, in 8 2, yeah, there's three star coins as normal and a secret exit. This secret exit. The secret exit is not hard to achieve. You just have to basically, at the end, you just have to turn left instead of right and then you'll get the secret exit. The only difficult thing about this level is probably these spikes, they come really fast at the pause. Alright guys, the first star coin is located right here, so I'll go uh, on the laser bar and just jump down onto it. Uh, it's pretty simple. I got damaged there, but you know, that's fine, I'll just carry on. Who cares if a spike hit me? my checkpoint, and I've also died as well. How nice. Alright. Okay, there's a red coin in here, so I can get my lives back that I've lost. Right, six, seven, eight, get all eight red coin rings and get eight ice power. How nice of the game to be a nice little ice power. Right, the second star coin, you see these two pipes here go beneath them. There's a hidden area with the second star coin inside of it. Right, so this part here, if you go down and go to the left, you'll get a secret exit. But there's a big spike ball here, jump over that and go to this secret area to get the third star coin. Once you've got the third star coin, you can just back out, out of there like this. Go through the pipe. Alright, and now you're here, just keep running all the way to the end. I reckon when you use this power block, it drops a lot of coins, so if you're interested in coins, use a power block, get some lives, and maybe I, I got a one up from that, so I'm on 98 lives now, I need to get back to 99 lives, I need to get top of the flag bomb. Alright, so guys, that was the secret exit, and now I'm going to move on to the normal exit of this level. Right, for the normal exit, once you get to this part here, it's quite simple. Instead of going left, you just you just go to the right and then go for this pipe here. Um, that was quite simple. That's how you get the normal exit. Right, the uh, secret exit, by the way, takes you straight to world 8-7, but the normal exit obviously takes you to 8-3. Uh, I'm, I'm going to try that again. 
Um, triple jump, top of the pole. We move on to 8 3 now. Right, here we are in 8 3. Uh, so, this level introduces the, the fire chomps back into the game. This level does contain fire chomps. Uh, the first star coin is right here. It's quite simple. Be careful with the lava. Just stay on the left side and then fall down to the star coin. Make sure you get back on the platform easily and then you'll uh, have the first star coin secured in the bag. Right, here's a thing. Right, now we're half over the checkpoint now, so that's quite. I died, never mind. Alright, here we are back at this checkpoint, but alright, so be careful of the lava because you can easily die here if you're not careful enough. And then just keep walking, and then if, you, if you're careful enough, you won't get hit by lava. The second star coin here, be careful of the lava. Walk carefully and you'll collect the second star coin without any damage occurring to you. Right, I, I want to get this mushroom in this question mark block. Right, right, there we go. Give me that before I fall in the lava. Don't fall in the lava yourself as well, because you... No. I haven't died yet so far, so that's something not good. Guys, can we get, um... If we can get 35 likes on this video, then your nan will come back to life, so you might want to start liking on the video. Guys, if we get 35 likes on this video, that might make your nan come back to life, so like the video and your nan might come back from the dead, so... Alright, well we've just finished 8-3, unlike Charlie Bragg, you can never do that, and now we move on to 8-Castle. Alright guys, here we are in 8-Castle. Right, so there's a little fire ambush, but it's quite easy to get past that. So once you're in this 8 dash castle, uh, this is one of the levels where um, they lie to you. They didn't put a checkpoint in the middle of the level, they put it at the very end, and then expect you to just move from there. Which is quite... it's not very nice of the game, but you know. First star coin's quite easy, you just jump up there, collect it, and move on. Uh, there's a secret door in here, which contains a second star coin, I believe. Never mind, it contains a roulette block. Can I get a propeller? Yes, I can. I must have a propeller suit. Right, now we've got a nice propeller suit. We can just fly away of this area very nicely and calmly. Uh, I have a power suit, so it's a lot easier for me to get past this section, but for you lot at home, it probably won't be, but, you know, just go to that roulette block, win yourself a... I've lost my propeller. That's not very nice, I've lost my propeller now, so it's going to make this level a lot harder, of course. Right, wait for this thing. Right, now we've got to wall jump very carefully, don't take damage to these fire bars, and you should be okay. Right, there's this platform bar here where you can die because you have there are only a couple of safe spots so just go to the safe spots and you will not die and then the second star coin uh there's two star coins here the second star coin is in this hidden block here where you can go through the door and collect the second star coin in this fire area and the third star coin as you just saw once you exit the door just jump up and slide and dig that fire bar and you'll get the third star coin but meanwhile we're on the second star coin so wait for this platform to come back all right not like that not like that Jump on the platform, get the star coin, and then uh, leave through this door. As soon as you leave through the door, jump up, bang, get that star coin, get the checkpoint. So it gives you all three star coins there, it gives you a checkpoint, that's actually quite rare. It gave you a checkpoint literally 10 seconds ago, now we're already at the end of the level. What was the point of that checkpoint? They should have made it a lot, uh, a lot, uh, what's the word? A lot. Uh, I don't know. Right, we're moving on to the boss fight against Chemic the Boy Witch. He's gay, so I don't like this boss fight because this boss fight is gay, so I don't like the boss fight because I don't like gay people because I'm not weird. Oh, so this, this, this little gay boy here just keeps teleporting around. You just have to get three hits on him, as every boss. Right, where... 
Okay, I died, but uh, we move. Right, I'm back again, lads. This time I'm not going to die on this boss fight because, you know, I'm a bit too good in this game, in my opinion. Right, and I've got one hit already. I just need to get two more hits and then this boss fight will be done. Right, now he's left. Right, there he is down there. Bosh, have that. That's two hits. One more hit on this boss fight and I'm done. There he is. He, he likes to spawn far away from you and then change his mind after a while. Bang, got my boss. I hit him and then I died. Alright, this time he is dead. Alright, done. Alright. We're now moving on to 8-4. If I ground pound, I go a lot faster on ground pound. I recommend you stay with this block thing because this can be useful because I mean it's a light source. Right, this is an underwater level. I'm, uh, not many people like underwater levels. I don't blame them. I mean, unless your name's Drano or something, in that case you might like them. But... The first star coin is up here, so you've got to get past these spike dummies and grab the first star coin. Bang. Right, use this light source. This light thing can also kill enemies, by the way, so I reckon you carry it and just fight like these spike dummies to kill it. I killed all these spike on it, they were not difficult to kill at all. Alright, now I, I believe there's a secret area down here where we can, where we can get some goodies. Alright, there's a secret pipe down here that not. So there's a secret pipe down here that not many people know about. It, it contains this purple fish on it and a couple of coins. So if you have enough, if you get enough coins, you can get a, a one up. I have 69 coins, that's very nice. But, okay, I'm just gonna leave through the pipe now. I nearly died. No, I don't wanna go back in the pipe. I just, I came out for a reason, pause. Right, the thing is, when you come out of this pipe, these, these spike on these respawn. I, don't, I can't kill them all again, because that just takes too long. Pause. And then, so you go through this pipe, the opposite pipe, and this takes you to the next part of the level, which contains the second star coin. Now that's very nice, because if you want to 100% the game, if you're a top G like me, you want to 100% the game, you have to get the second star coin, obviously. Right, the bad thing about this star coin is, uh, when you hit this switch, obviously it releases star coins, but it also releases a bunch of bloopers. I desperately do not like bloopers. They can go die. I don't think any... I just died to a blooper. Alright, I was back again at this part of the section. This time I have a firefly, so I can kill the bloopers. As I said, I don't think anyone likes bloopers, so... You might want to recommend having a firefly. Hit the switch, kill these blooper donnies, get your star coin, and then bounce, guys. Oh, this is green fish as well. Oh, I got hit by a blooper while I wasn't even looking, man. Okay. Right, down here there, I believe there's a hidden one up. Yeah, see this block here? This contains a one up. So if you need a life, go to this level and you get our secret one up. And then evacuate the area and leave. Right, the third star coin is in this area as well, so. Right. Okay, I've died to that. I nearly died to that fish, but. Just be careful with these light stingray things, I don't know what they're called, but I don't know, just, they're very, very annoying. And they've just killed me, how nice. Right, back again in this section. This time we're not going to die, unlike your man. And, uh, please, please, please get, I recommend you get this mushroom in here. I died to these things again, Matt. Right, back again, guys. So, we're about to get this hidden one up again. Uh, these spike things are very annoying right now, and they've killed me. How rude. Oh, I 
got this weak thing race, man. I keep taking damage to me. I also missed the third star coin. Where is it? Right, this light, this stingray thing is blocking it. We need to make him move out of the way. Yeah, and then the third star coin is right behind it. That's all three star coins in 8 4. And then now we we'll move on to 8 5 when I can get through this bloody pipe. Right, guys, once we get top of the stop, once we get top of the flight bar, because I'm just very good like that. Messed up my triple jump anyway. And triple jump, top of the flight pole. There we go, calm as you like. Right, now it's time for 8-5. Okay, I don't like this level. This level is an auto scroll level. It moves very, very slowly. There's 400 seconds on the clock. By the time we finish the level, we'll say like 100, probably. Right, there's a first star point. It's very early into that level. You just basically jump up, collect it, and move on. Right, I just recently checked one. I'm going to edit out a lot of this level, because I'll do that with auto scrolls, because they're just very boring, and I don't know what to commentate. Alright, so, okay, just after the checkpoint, get this bomb and throw him at the second star coin. Alright, for the third star coin, just jump in the air and receive it. Pause. And then, uh, that's all three star coins. And now we're going to move on from 8-5 to 8-6. We've nearly done world 8, guys. We're nearly there. Alright, uh, just dodge these crows. Go through this, uh, the bomb hit me. Right, go to this pipe to your, to your right, or... To your left if you're disabled. Um, but do a triple jump, get top of the flagpole and move on to 8-6. Alright guys, 8-6, here we are. This uh, this level contains a propeller, so it's actually this is actually quite a fun level now. It's very underrated. Yeah, underrated, not overrated, underrated, yeah, that's what I meant. Alright, so Right, so uh, the first star coin we're approaching in a second. Right, so you need a propeller for this, otherwise you can't collect it. Actually, no, you don't need a propeller, you can use a spring if you want, but it's a lot more difficult. So you need to go on the very left side and just go up that way, because if you go to the middle, you cannot uh, exit and go back. I'm going to collect all these peas, which you can You know, I'm a bit too good at this. Right. I missed two peas, which coins. I'm ashamed of myself. Shame on me. Right. I missed the second star coin. I flew too high and I've missed it, so I'm gonna to have to die and come back. But basically, just don't go up here and go to the very left side again and collect the star coin like that. That simple. Uh, I might just wait for a lava to come up and kill me so I can just replay the level and get out a star coin for you guys. Uh, and, and, bosh, I'm dead. Alright, we're approaching the end of the level, we're approaching the third star coin. Uh, this one, you don't need to propeller flight, you can just jump on there, jump on that block thing and then just get in like that. And then go up this pipe. And we are done with um, uh, 8-6, and now we move on to 8-7 uh, um, airship, and then we're nearly done. Alright guys, 8 airship, this is a boss fight against Bowser Jr. And obviously after this Bowser Jr. fight, we have the big battle with Bowser. Guys, put in the comments, who do you think is going to win, me or Bowser? I reckon me. Right, there's a hidden propeller right here, by the way. Right, if you just ground pound these boxes, there's a hidden propeller there. So if you're wondering... Okay, so you do need, you do need a propeller for the third star coin. Even though that's, that's very far away. I just got the first one, but I've lost my propeller. Don't worry, there, there is another hidden peak of one uh, here in this pot. If you, look, if you look in the boxes, there is a hidden driver as well, so if you look close enough, you, are, you will find one. Well, I, I see this green pipe here? You have to go down it, but you have to wait for it to rotate anti-clock. Wait, I don't know what anti-clockwise means, I'm just going to say it because it sounds cool. It rotates anti-clockwise, I think, and then you go down it. Of course. Alright, uh, I'm going to use my... I don't need those screw things, I've got a propeller. Alright, so make sure you keep this propeller, as I said, you need this propeller for the third star coin. I nearly died there, I nearly got squished, but I didn't, because, well, why would I? Alright, uh, this screw here, this is just coins, right? Yeah, this is just coins. If you want to collect some coins, 
I use the screw there and collect coins, I guess. Guys, I've got 99 lives and I've got 69 coins. That's just, that's perfect. Alright, right, hang on. I'm going to collect these, uh, if, if you don't have a propeller, you can probably just collect these eight uh, red coins and then, uh, What? Oh, I just died, and I've lost my propeller as well. Okay guys, because I've lost my propeller, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to have to connect a second controller and just throw Luigi at it, because you need a propeller to get that, and I've lost it, and I don't have any backup, so... I'm going to have to load the level and then just throw Luigi at it. Second Star Coin's easy though, just got to jump in the middle of them and then collect Star Coin like that. Right, the good thing with Luigi is it, like, you can get more power-ups, so... Guys, boom. Right, so you got to go on the... Mario has to go on this screw to, to reveal the first Star Coin and then get your other controller. Well, actually, I'll no, just pick up... Wait. Right, I need to pick up Luigi. Right, can, they, can I just jump down and get it? I do not think so. I, I, maybe I can wall jump off the wall and get it? I'm just going to try and throw Luigi at it. Right, okay, I, I messed up the first time. But Luigi has four more lives, so he's going to come back four more times. And hopefully we can get him this time. Right. Right, so grab Luigi. And then... Just throw him. Right, there we go. That's how you get the third star coin. Either do that or use a propeller and be a genius. Right, okay, well, how rude of you. And now I'm little going into the final. Luigi, you stole my mushroom, you little twat. How dare you? You know what, I'm throwing you off the edge again. I mean, I do actually prefer Luigi, but not in. But when I'm playing as Luigi, when I'm playing as Mario, I don't want Luigi stealing my mushrooms, okay? Basically, for this Bowser Jr. fight there, uh, he's going to be in his big, what, what do you think it's called? Car. We're just going to call it a car. It's definitely not a car, but it is. So he's going to be in his big car. I need to ground pound. Ground pound his bomb and make it hit him in the face three times and then he'll die. That's how the boss fight works. He dodged it, how dare you? And I've died. How sad. Right, back again. That's what I found this time. Got my first set on Bowser Jr. Uh, ground pound. Oh, he's dodged it again. This guy's very good at dodging balls for some reason. That's a bit, a bit questionable, Big Bowser Jr. Uh, put a ground pound. No, uh, ground pound! Oh, that was the final hit, and now we've beat Bowser Jr. Okay. Alright, guys. Uh, so, in this cutscene here, it shows Peach. You think, oh, we're going to rescue Peach. Well, no, you're not. Kemic, the gay boy witch, is going to take her and bring her to Bowser's castle. So, you've, you've still got to do the Bowser fight. This cutscene's quite boring, by the way, guys. I've just realised I forgot to play 8-7, so now we're gonna have to go back and play 8-7. Right, so I've gotta do 8-7, and then we've got the final Bowser battle, and then uh, we're done with World 8, and then we move on to World 9. I know we disconnect Luigi quickly because, well, no respect to my homie Luigi, but I don't need you anymore, so just um, leave, please. Oh, Luigi, you're my guy, but for 8 that's 7, I only require Mario, so um, you're gonna have to leave. 8 that's 7 is actually quite a difficult level, uh, so. Uh, that's quite diff that's sad for me. Right. I get a fire flower, that's nice in the game. They've, they've obviously seen that I'm a respectable guy, and they've said, go on, give him a fire flower. So, uh, big, big respect to Nintendo. I, uh, I believe the first star coin's coming up soon. So for the first star coin, if it actually comes up. By the way, if you if you like ground pound on the very front of him, I know that's really risky, but he, he does a weird points, so that's fun, I guess. So if, like, if you ground pound the front of wait, let me do it again quickly. So if you ground pound the very front of him, he goes, <laughs> goes like that. And that's quite fun, I guess. 
Right, and so the third star, the first star coin is coming up. So basically, he's about to drop down, and then right, right. So there's three drops. First one, no star coin. I killed myself in the process. How nice. Right, I'm back again at this part. Right, so you just got to do a very light jump. Make sure you don't fall in the lava like an idiot. And collect the star coin, and then move on with your day. I reckon Dryer would have definitely fell in for that part, but if you're not like Dryer, collect it and move on. Like the second star coin is easy, you just got to jump in the air to get it, like it's quite simple. Unless you, if you're not paying attention, I guess you can miss it, but just pay attention, like you're playing the game for a reason, pay attention. I don't know who would not be paying attention to that. I would be a very silly person would not pay attention to that. There's a secret uh, by here, by the way. It just contains a fire flower, but I mean, if you don't have one, go there and get one. Right? It's quite simple. I've just died again. What an idiot. Right, I'm back at this part again. This time I'm not going to ground pound off the edge of the spine coaster. Right guys, we're about, to, we're about to approach the third star coin, but this one's quite simple. There's now two roller coasters down the bottom one, get the star coin, back in the net, and then we move on. That's all three star coins in this level. And uh, now approaching the end of the level, I'm going to get top of the flight pole, because I always do. And then get flight Alright, and now we move on to the final boss fight of Bowser. Okay guys, moving on to the final boss. Can you believe it guys, we're going to fight Bowser. Uh, name me someone that can fight Bowser that begins with D, because I can't think of anyone. Uh, I, I do have a uh, mini mushroom, by the way, guys, because, you know, I'm, I'm quite good at this game, so I don't think I need power-ups, to be honest with you. Uh, as you guys can see, I have already played this level, but uh, there was a malfunction, so we're replaying it. So ignore the fact that I have the three star coins. Nice. Alright guys, we're coming up to the first star coin. The first star coin is not difficult at all, but some people, I'm not going to say any names, might not be able to collect this. It's very easy though, you just got to fall down and jump at the very last moment. Well, just make sure you don't, go, make sure you don't dodge these fire, fire bars, they'll be very dumb. That'll be like a very something moment. So just don't do that. Guys, soon we'll be moving on to the final Bowser fight. Can you believe it? You guys even know who Bowser is? That's my uncle. And I'm about to fight him. So let's go. Alright, second star coin is right here. It's quite simple. Uh, we'll jump off the walls to get it. Alright guys, here we go. There is a checkpoint. You're probably wondering. You're probably thinking I missed a star coin. I didn't. The, the star coin's in the final boss. So don't worry. I didn't miss any star coins, guys. But anyway, uh, I'm not going to be mini Mario for this boss fight. I'm going to get a mushroom. Because I don't want to fight Bowser's mini Mario. Right, mate. Okay, I've already got hit by the fire. That's a very dull move. That's a very dry in a moment. Right, just don't get hit by the firebars, unlike me, and then you should be fine with this boss fight. Uh, I'm now little Mario. What the hell? Right, you gotta wait for Bowser to jump, and you run underneath him, and then hit the switch, and then that's it. He's jumping, he's jumping, he's jumping. Run, run! Right, that was close. Uh, hit the switch. And yeah, guys, that was the final boss fight against Bowser. Hope you guys enjoyed. Next, goodbye. Just joking guys, you thought that was it for Bowser? That's not Peach, that's the, the gay boy witch guy, Kemic. I don't like him because he's gay, but anyway, he brings Bowser back to life. He, he brings Bowser back to life, and then watch this guys, you're not going to believe it. Oh. Oh wow, very epic. Right, yeah, we have to fight Bowser more by the way guys. Remember. Honestly, like... It was Jana's fault because she could have checked that Bowser was actually dead. Because like, just because we hit a switch on him doesn't mean he's going to die. Like, 
You need confirmation. So that that, that was her fault. Right, uh, basically the third star coin's coming up. By the way, the third and final star coin. Uh, it's right there. What you got to do? See these platforms? Uh, just jump off and get the star coin. Simple. Go there, then go there, and then get the star. Uh, don't be intimidated by this Goomba. There was a one-up in that block, by the way, but obviously I don't need one, so... I, I suggest you make it to this part as Big Mario, so you can ground pound, get a propeller, and this makes this level so much easier with, with a propeller mushroom equipped. Right, you go down the right. epic platforming moments that are going to be needed for this. Uh, you can do this part without a propeller suit, but it's a lot uh, dif more difficult. Maybe it is more difficult because of certain reasons, but we never know. But anyway, Peach is right here, so this time if you actually hit the switch, bars are actually die for real. Uh, so you hit the switch, and uh, that's it, you're done with Lucy from Abu Wii. I hope you guys enjoyed this walkthrough. Bowser's just going to drown in lava. Uh, so yeah, this is... I hope you guys enjoyed. Goodbye.